Hi there and welcome to this quick tutorial video on how to use the deal no deal calculator by ZA Home. So you will have downloaded this Excel sheet for estate agents from our website and I'm going to take you through this Excel sheet now. You will see that there are green, yellow and gray fields on the sheet. We ask that you please only fill in the 13 green fields on the sheet. Now those are also the only fields that you can fill in as we've locked the others to make this pretty straightforward. So please supply the ones in green, the ones in yellow will auto calculate and the ones in grey are hard coded and are fixed values for this purpose. Now the first thing we require from you is the market value of the property in question and this market value should preferably come from either Lightstone, CMA or TPN or a similar service. The next one is the purchase price and this is the price that you think the seller will accept for the sale. Then this will calculate automatically the below market value percentage if any as well as the RAND value discount based on those two metrics. The next one to supply is whether the seller is VAT registered yes or no, the nature of the property which can be changed from freehold to sectional title, the interest rate we have fixed two of them over here We've fixed the deposit for zero, that can be changed down the line. The estimated revamp costs that you estimate this property would attract. Time frame, we have them as 20 years over here. The rental income, then this must please be the realistic rental income that you think this property could fetch. Now, depending on the strategy, this might be a wildly different figure between a student accommodation, for instance, versus a standard buy to let. So please apply just your own opinion of what a realistic rental could be. The monthly bond payment as well as bond costs and transfer costs will be calculated. Then you can please supply the monthly insurance that you think the property would fetch, levies if it's a sectional title, and rates and taxes for freehold or sectional title. We can see we've hard-coded the management fee maintenance and incidentals as well as any vacancies or voids. This will give us a calculated monthly cash flow RAND amount, the capital investment that this deal seems to require, the ROI and the gross yield on this property. Now the last four questions is whether the seller will consider an installment sale and we have some other videos on what an installment sale consists of but this will just be a simple yes no response. And then lastly, we require your details so that we can be in touch with you once you have submitted the sheet. So the first thing is just your email address, your full name and your cell number. And with your cell number to please start it with 27 since it will drop to zero in this case. Now, at the end over here, we have eight cells in orange, four on the left, four on the right. This will tell us whether there is a potential deal on our hands. We either have a deal on the price because we're buying it significantly below market value. And in this case, we can see we have a no deal on that. Then we have a deal on the yield or the net cash flow on this property that was calculated above. And it seems that we might have a deal on our hands even at different interest rates because this one on the left runs at nine, this one runs at 10 and a half. And we have a potential deal here on an installment sale because it says that the seller will potentially take an installment sale agreement. Now, if you get a deal response on any one of these eight fields, then please send the sheet through to us so that we can be in contact with you and discuss the deal further and see if we can assist the seller. Thank you very much. We look forward to doing business with you and we appreciate your time.